hey hi guys uh, so today word is uh, solo s o l o now that doesn't mean solo means solo traveling but it cover a lot of different aspect the solo means the definition it says the only one person or only yourself so nowadays in digital uh, generation or you know this is a uh, social media generation we are feel very lonely or we feel solitude most of the time so to so like you know even i feel that uh, thing so for cope up with that thing you should you know know yourself very well and you should uh, actually enjoy with yourself you should make the friend yourself so how can you read like i heard that you know the quote uh, it say ki जो बंदा और बंदी वो अकेले सिंगल में जाके वो थिएटर में मूवी देख सके वो कुछ भी कर सकते हैं एंड दैट इज एक्चुअली ट्रू बिकॉज इट टेक लॉट ऑफ एफर्ट्स टू गो यू नो अलॉन विथ एनी एनी प्लेस और इवन मूवी थिएटर और इवन कैफे कैरिया और एनी थिंग बिकॉज वी आर यूज टू गो विथ कंपनी राइट विथ फ्रेंड्स एंड फैमिलीज वी कैन गो आउटसाइड अलॉन सो there is thing about so in solo like uh, for me i sta- i started like uh, you know uh, start with the solo traveling and to be honest first i was so fearing out ki what happened and where we are stay and you know which kind of people i will meet and yeah definitely you fear out but to be honest you just have to try and believe me you just you know enjoy that thing and i just started and after that i just like okay this is so cool thing i meet sort of lots of people and lots of different diverse background uh, person and you know it will uh, you know open my horizon so uh, you know like just try to go with yourself and uh, like go with ca- ca- solo dating a go with a uh, movie dating or with yourself because you know eventually you know know the yourself very well and once you know yourself very well then you definitely move forward to what you want in life so i'll tell you the advantage of the solo thing yeah so one of the advantage is like you know self discovering obviously uh, you are you know when you go the solo traveling you just uh, discover yourself like because you are the only who traveling that uh, place or particular destination so this is like you know yourself like what is your need what what kind of atmosphere you like and you know uh, how you tackle this uh, difficulties the second point is the in- independence obviously you are going for the solo travel so you are only lonely person and you get your independence so you can do anything you can go anywhere and you are you know to explore anything it's it's up to you and next thing is a flexibility now if you are going particular direction so like last time i go to hampi right so i go to solo journey so i have that flexibility to i can go anywhere in you know that south hampi or north hampi i can do customization in my itinerary and um, that is the best thing to go solo because if you are go with company or any related sort of you know you do auto rickshaw or anything so you just in that you know bond ki okay i have limit limited thing or i have limited time so that is the you know advantage of the personal growth obviously you are alone in that the journey so personal growth in, in terms of the like uh, you meet lots of lots of people and you learn from there definitely first thing is the communication and uh, apart from that you learn how to do problem solving because suppose uh, last time i do hitchhiking and and uh, with, like it's been one or two or i didn't get any lift so some people are good to give but some are not that good so i have to find a problem to you know the prop solving ki how can i reach my place or i can reach within a certain limit for certain time right so you are become a actually problem the next point is the less drama uh, less drama in the sense you, know, you are going with your friends and family so you are you know becoming independent with those people but if you are lonely then you don't have to do anything or 
act like that so you just are even solely based on yourself and you are do anything here you can do meditation you can do yoga or anything so you eventually find your inner peace in your thing is the memorable experience like you meet lot of people and you go to different kind of places right you click with photos and i suggest you just go with camera and you will capture your best moment there and that is the best advantage of the solo uh, it will definitely increase your social skills because if you are going solo you can't speak with anyone you have to speak with uh, you know people like like you right they are traveling so i remember i started my journey from the bangalore and i met lot of people in the uh, train because i start to talk with them if you if i can't talk then i can't meet that people and i can't make them friends right so they are local or from that humpy and they give lot of insight from that what is good what is good cafe to go out and what is the good place and which best time is that so that is beneficial to you know start a talk with that people because they will definitely help you and everything everything come with the, you know pros and cons now cons in the solo traveling is like you know you should very well secured because uh, we can't say this pers- the the place is good or bad because when you reach then then we know he okay this place is good or bad you should be very well prepared like you should have very handy you know weapon thing to you know if suppose you are in difficulty you should be uh, move out from the difficulty and you should at least research before the going their destination so that is like my advice to you and if you want to know more just ping me or my insta social uh, instagram so i'll definitely help you and that's it thank you